What's up, YouTube? This is the Eric Volpe, and it's time to get dangerous with the Pokemon Black and White Wi-Fi battle. This battle is against my friend Naranagi, and well, it was a really good battle. Um, I'm actually testing my theme team for Elo's tournament here. Um, to be honest, I don't care if my opponent sees it. If you want to spend your life trying to counter team me, have fun. And then I guess Pokemon is serious shit to you. But you know what? You know, I was bored, I needed team tests, he said sure, so we had a really good game here. So, I lead off with my Alphonse, when it's obviously Zoroark based on the HP, he has a lead train. I guess he was predicting the Metagross elite, so he felt smart. I get my Focus Bless off, I think I missed the first one, so he got a sub that I missed one, that matters in my opinion. He protects, so now he gets to see my superpower, so... Now, I switch out, predicting him to switch out, and I get the switch, and I get the right switch in. Now, knowing Rapushin can take a Gengar's Shadow Ball, I just stay in, I go for the payback, and down goes his Gengar, except not really, because he has a Focus Sash. Then I'm like, oh, Face Bomb, and I'm like, you know what, I don't want to take a Focus, but I don't want to take it our Shadow Ball and lose my Rapushin early, so I'll go into Metagross. And, well, he withdraws his Gengar, and I kind of predicted that, because he was fearing the bullet punch. So, I go so I go for my um, self rocks, so which makes that Gengar useless either way. So, now he goes into his Repulsion. I do say, but I get the flinch. You can argue it mattered, but what could he really done rather than maybe Paybacked, and then, like, almost killed me? So, not really. So, now, he goes into his Zora, his, um, Scissor. I go for the Earthquake. He pr I predicted him very nicely. So now, I switch out into Edward. No link to Fire Blast, except not really because of crit. Link goes to the brakes. So, I go for the U-turn. He wants switch, for switch Advantage, so he stays in, which is very smart. You know, it's also racking up some damage on my Hei Daruma. I don't even know how. How did I get damage on him? Oh well, so I go into my Deoxys defense form, knowing I can cripple him with anything, knowing I can take a U-turn too, I stay in, um, I guess he predicts me very nicely here, I wanted to go for the spikes, or the recover, I just wasn't thinking there, that was my fault, that one goes into the scissor, and well I guess greed isn't going to be much help here, but I know a Hedruma can take a U-turn, not nicely, but enough. But now as Repushin comes out, this is my choice scarf to Hidoruma. So I want to save this because if I can get rid of Scissor and this, he loses his priority. And well, he goes for the Mog Punch like I thought. My leftovers actually puts me exactly right back at what the what the damage was from the Mog Punch. So I go for the recover, not really fearing anything. I know I should be fearing the payback, but he predicts that very nicely. Goes for the bulk up. And leftovers happen, and I go for the knockoff here. Just, I guess, predicting the scissor. Stupid me was stupid. Um, so he goes up for the payback, even that plus one. This is a dark card, uh, Deoxys, yeah, dark card defense. Deoxys defense is very bulky. I predict the payback, so I switch it in the Metagross. I stand, I go for Zen Head, but down goes his Repulsion, which is always nice. And if you're gonna be like, asking me why I'm not calling these guys by their. English name, I don't like him, I don't know him, so who cares? So he goes on to his Dragonite. Um, knowing by the leftovers is the bulky Dragonite with Marvel Scale, I know I really don't need to worry about this thing. So I go for the Thunder Wave just so I can guarantee myself being faster than anything. And maybe I want to try to set up, but he gets a crit. And wait, again, those are the breaks. So I go out on the Scar, I go for the Sarge, and it misses! So, those are the breaks! <laughs> uh, oh my god. Wow, I forgot this bell. So now I go in my Repushin, and I'm like, you know what? These are the breaks. I bulk up. If I remember right? Yep, I bulk up. And, well, he goes for, I think, the Lava Pool? Yes, he does. So I'm hoping for the burn here, because a burn on this thing would be amazing, and I get the burn. I get my bulk up. He was predicting me going for the, for the um, Drain Punch, which I kind of should have. Just looking at this, I think I was predicting to protect. Um, uh, 69, low, low. So I go for the Mach Punch, definitely kills. I'm at 94 HP, not really a good place to be. He goes in the Scissor. 
I do have the two, I do have the two, um, bowl cups, but that's a choice made in Scissor. What do I do about that? And I lose the battle. That was a very good game, Nagi. Um, a little bit hacksy, but a little breaks. You know, I'm not gonna spend time bitching about what could have taken what. And to be honest, I didn't know if I would have lost this battle. I, it's so old, I haven't looked at it. So, you know, those are the breaks. I should really stop saying that soon, but I'm in a good mood, so who cares? Okay, that's all for now, YouTube. I will catch you guys later for two to four days, somewhere in that time area. I do have some, I do have a tourney battle to post. I, not the best results for me. Oh well, you win some, you lose some, you know? Alright, so I will catch you guys later. Peace.